Yeah, that's, uh, that's why I said, you know, so I have the idea, or, you know, many years, I always question, you know, why the people have to go to church, they have to close their eyes. Why they're going to be Buddhists on the mountain, they have to close their eyes. Why they, when they're meditating, they close their eyes. I, you know, my, so many questions in my mind, all those years build up. And if I can close my eyes to make a painting, yeah, I, because that's, a, I get bored with my eyes, what's I going to do? What's my eyes to see, see more like I could copy whatever the uh, nature throw at me. Oh, trees, copy that. Somebody walk in the same day, are you going to copy their body or you copy their face, copy their eyes? But I still think that's more copy, just a different way to copy. Uh, yeah. So I think it'd be a real artist. Uh, I th I start thinking you need a blindfold, a pen from your inside. What's everything? What do you want? And uh, also you don't really want to know what you you exactly you, you plan to do because you want to follow the nature, what to follow inside your mind, your body, spirits lead to you. Yeah, you want to, your your. They need whatever they need to you to do, you should do, and you accept whatever the results. Just like the mother nature, they created this. You accept that whatever mm -hmm. is. You don't want to change anything. Yeah. And uh, just like uh, people make babies, they don't try to think about how the baby is going to look exactly. They can just make it. Just like artists make a baby, the babies come out, and they, they, the babies is my art. I like that, that's a good analogy. Yeah, exactly. So you accept whatever they come out. Mm -hmm. You don't say, oh, my, this is the, the baby is not that I, I plan to have, so I don't want that baby. So my art is like my baby, you know. You, yeah. Once you plan for it, just like, a, like you make love with something. Yeah. You know, sure. it doesn't make things happen. Just makes things happen. Yeah, yeah. Can you talk a little bit about your the evolution of your art? Because when you first came to, yeah. to our gallery, at least, yeah. in like the two years that I've experienced yeah. Yeah, yeah. you being here, first you came in and your works were like you brought in like the rice paper works or like the the works that you did of people's faces yeah. that were mixed media. Yeah. And then you started with the skulls, and then you started branching out yeah. into. What um, I do is yeah, in the beginning is so more related with the yin and yang, okay. with my medicine. So you can see I do a lot of rice paper work. This is, you know, this is not a blindfolded, but this is more like a blindfolded because you, you, you don't, I just throw colors and brush them up, see whatever they are, okay. and accept that. So, but it's a little different, but then I do those uh, birds and stuff, and make a color of a different color. And also, this is more like a blindfolded because I have layers of rice paper. Yeah. When I paint the top, the, the bottom will already come out, okay. but I don't know what the bottom is going to come out. Okay. See, that's how they, how they develop the plan for the art. So you, you accept whatever happened, the, the legs layers. So that's where the you know, I have layers of the rice paper uh, work to paint on the top so, one. And then you would remove the top layers? Yeah, then I take the... Uh, Top okay. one out, and the bottom one already have a painting. That's then you work on the painting. So, so you accept whatever the first yeah. one you do. That so means like a, I don't know what the next one is going to happen. So it's so more I expect it. So that's then related with the with the Taoism, with the Yin and Yang, with the balance, mm -hmm. and also we related with the accepting things and uh, how much. You, you know, it's the more you get into yin and yang to understand. So, because in China, when even you learn the medicine about yin and yang, mm -hmm. so they don't allow you to understand what the yin and yang come from. Actually, yin and yang is from Taoism. So, so Taoism, so they have a Tao Te Ching and a Hua Bu Jing. Is this something that you, is Taoism something that you've followed since you were little? Or when like I, when you already learned about the atmosphere, Chinese, okay. they already have in their blood. They have those things. Only then is once the this, the uh, uh, first the capitalist, uh, the uh, you know, or the early then communist, mm -hmm. once they come, they just mislead guide you. They don't want you to do the traditional thing. So they want you to make sure follow the communist. So in China, if you want to do Taoism, you know, you want to do do believe 
Tao mm -hmm. to try to help people, they don't they don't think you try to help in the help the communists. So they don't allow you to go to the they're going to maybe send you to the jail. Okay. And sometimes you can can get be killed. So they can be that serious. So here, after I come here, then I started connected with the, this yin and yang, Chinese medicine, mm -hmm. related with the Tao. Then my patients like my work, which work they like, then I compare with their physical condition, how why they like it. Then it started then, then become I have a diagnosis. That's yeah. why I do series of we use arts for diagnosis. Yeah. Because when they they have to love certain things because the physical withdrawal. Yeah. So that's why the physical, mental, spiritual condition. So make them to like this art. That's why it gives me more getting to Tao and uh, to understand the universe yeah. and uh, how the Tao teach us. So, so the whole idea is just uh, all accept the things, accept the nature, accept what we have, and uh, don't try to force things. And uh, you, you follow the flow, enjoy what you do, just like uh, I make art, but I don't force things. And uh, you always enjoy it, you try to do the right things, and uh, sometimes not to come out the things you want, but sometimes they happen by reason. Because the, the mother nature, the uh, supernatural, mm -hmm. the skill natural, they mm -hmm. try to push you, you around to do different, do different things, mm -hmm. but it's not necessarily bad. They just actually, if you're going to follow them, they're going to lead you to the right direction. So that's why I find uh, come here, you know, because uh, the beginning, you know, Fernando don't uh, uh, don't believe anything <laughs> until I come here. Then he probably understand a little bit about Taoism, whatever. Yeah, yeah, right yeah. yeah he's starting to smooth out a little bit. You know, he's not as crazy like before. <laughs> <laughs> With your acupuncture, and the yeah, because the suction cup acupuncture or get some balance or the the, the Taoism idea. You know, even I talk about you know <laughs> so many times he 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 think about this crazy artist. What to, what what's going to do about? with it? Yeah. Um, when did you get the idea to videotape yourself? Yeah, that's just a very good question. I, this is that's why I, everything is by reason, happen mm -hmm. by reason. See, one day I walk on the Grand Avenue because that's an Apple store just opened. Okay. You know, uh, I mean not not long, just a couple of weeks or months. Okay. And I go there. And I walk in, I said, all oh, those things look so beautiful. And uh, I said, uh, so good, this looks so beautiful, you want to buy one? I said, no, I don't buy anything, I don't buy a computer. I don't need a computer, I mean, I, you know, I practice Chinese medicine. Everything is in my mind, I just write down whatever I want to write down. I don't need a computer. I said, uh, they said, why you don't need the computer? It's very popular. I said, it's a pain in the neck. You know, when they break down, I have to find somebody. The people don't show up. They come here, charge me a pound of money, didn't fix anything. I don't know nothing about the computer. I don't need it. They said, no, here's a different. You buy this computer, if you have problem, we fix for you. You see, they have a genius bar there. I said, oh, that's the people fix computer? Yes, maybe I should buy one. I said, uh, how are they going to fix it? I said, I said, oh, any problem. And also, I said, I don't know how to... <laughs> Sorry, keep going. Yeah, okay. And also, the, I said, the, I, don't, uh, I don't, you can fix it, but I don't know how to use it. Mm -hmm. Why I have to buy the computer if I, I don't use much, you know? I don't uh, have email, I don't have nothing. I don't, uh... Art statement. Worship the unnameable and unexpected art, the yin, yet embrace and be indiscriminate towards all art, the yang. Observe the world and one's outer surroundings, yet trust one's inner vision and intuition. As such, I use a blindfold to create art through the inner spirit, yin, which in turn can be absorbed through the eyes, yang. By using art as holistic medicine, we can all benefit from the mystery of art, balancing ourselves physically mentally and spiritually. My art is a remedy promoting a harmonious way of life. Furthermore, it is a prescription for a new wave of art.